And we have another beautiful day ahead of us. Lots of sunshine, temperatures warming into the upper 80s once again. And then, yes, we have some big changes as we head into the week. And out there right now, we've got some sunshine. We'll call it partly sunny skies. Temperatures in the 80s across the plains, 60s for the mountains. And your forecast high for the Denver metro area today, 88 degrees, partly cloudy skies. A little bit breezy, though, with winds out of the east uh, gusting up to 20 miles per hour. So warm, not quite record territory. That record 94 degrees. We're going to cool off from here on out though as we head into the weekend. Forecast highs across the plains. We're looking mainly 80s, just a few 90s, especially down there across the southeast corner of the state. 60s and 70s up in the mountains. Talk about a temperature swing. I talked about that big changes and those big changes in our weather. Well, how about uh, 30 plus degrees cooler than today on Sunday? So our forecast high today. 88 degrees, our forecast high for Sunday, 56. We have a cold front moving through tomorrow, and that's really going to drop those temperatures and change things up. Take a look at our satellite radar right now, still under the influence of a weak ridge of high pressure. That is going to shift, and things are going to start changing. Tonight, however, mostly clear still. 53 degrees, our overnight lows cool, a little bit breezy still as we head into the overnight hours. Tomorrow, again, things changing. We have the cold front moving through, so temperatures topping out right around 69, 70 degrees, so much cooler tomorrow. And again, we have uh, a very potent uh, system moving through that's going to bring us some afternoon showers transitioning to steady to heavy rain overnight. And that happens about after about 3 o'clock. Those winds a little gusty as well, up to 25 miles per hour. So forecast highs tomorrow, much cooler, 60s and 70s across the plains, 50s and 60s up in the mountains. All right, let's put our forecast into motion. And we are going to track that rain as it moves in. As we head into tomorrow morning, we're looking good, but 3 o'clock, we do see those showers move in widespread over the high country into the metro area. Just light rain right around 3 o'clock, but heavier rain as you head south on I-25. This is 5 o'clock. That rain starts to transition to that slushy snow up there in the mountains, and we get some moderate rain fall here in the metro area. Again, 5 o'clock. A little bit of a break, just a short, brief break, but 10 o'clock rolls around, and there you can see widespread snow in the high country. Rain up and down the I-25 quarter that includes the metro area and that continues overnight. Do you want to talk about a winter weather advisory for the West uh, Mosquito Range is Swatch Mountains uh, for tomorrow into Sunday for up to 12 or up to seven inches of snow. So significant snowfall up there in the high country. We do have a weather impact day. We're talking about tomorrow afternoon into Sunday morning due to a half an inch to an inch of rain likely in the metro area. Several inches of snow above 9,000 feet and snow even possible as low as 7,000 feet. So how much rain are we talking about? Well, this model is showing about seven tenths of an inch when all is said and done here in the metro area. So again, we are calling Saturday afternoon, Sunday morning, weather impact days due to that system moving through. Fall officially starts on Sunday. It is going to feel like it, a high of 56 degrees.